Hi everyone, I'm out here in Sedona on an impromptu trip and I want to share something I learned with you, something pretty cool. A hundred years for us is a long time, usually a lifetime, and actually to a cactus it's not. So each arm on a cactus represents 100 years. So if you have a cactus that has five arms on it, each of those arms represents a year. So it would be 500 years old. Pretty cool, huh? I love learning on this journey and meeting people on, as I go. And behind me, you'll see this is the masculine side of a vortex here. One of the most popular vortexes in Sedona, which is it's in Boynton Canyon. And it's at the end of Vista Trail. And I'll pan around here behind me so you can see this one. It looks huge, of course, because it's behind me. But this is the female version of it. So just an amazing place. This, this whole area is amazing and life is to be enjoyed. So please enjoy yours. And this area was made popular uh, recently by a man named Jess Jerobs, who you can read about. His last name is spelled J-E-R-O-B. And he wrote a book about his experience here where he entered uh, some rocks, there was some fire that ensued and a Native American stepped through and told him he was gonna paint paintings. <laughs> and he thought, are you kidding me? Like all I've painted right now is my friend's room, literally. And he was told he was going to paint paintings and murals and he was going to be selling them. It seemed ludicrous to him. And I'm telling you this because sometimes the most inspired things that you will ever get are absolutely crazy. You'll think there's no way in hell that I can do that but you can because you were inspired to do it. It was divine, it was given to you, and you don't have to know how. You just have to step out in faith and do it. So Jess Jerobs did just that. He went back to Santa Fe and he created, I'll put some links on my Facebook if you're interested. He's got a constellation out there and he did move 500 pounds of rock to form it, but he also sells paintings. <laughs> And he sells them for thousands of dollars, some of them, and people buy them and they get them home and they have their miracle or they get their healing and many of them bring them back to him so that he can resell them and other people can benefit from their own healing. So fabulous story and I know it sounds crazy, but visions and inspiration that's given to you is yours so take it and run with it and it does require faith i think that's why we don't get all the steps to it is because it requires faith faith and if we knew every step that we were going to have to take we would probably not even take the first one so for those of you who are brave and going to step out there kudos to you keep doing it life is to be enjoyed and i'm going to go ahead and enjoy the rest of my day here in sedona